Uh, just a quick video just to show um, this rather nice box that I'm using for, at work at the moment, which basically is called a neat uh, two-way HDMI smart splitter. So this is to split a HDMI cable two ways to two different monitors. So uh, we weren't sure at work whether this was functioning, so I brought it home just to test it out. It's very cheap, about 30 quid from Amazon, so it's well worth it over more expensive models. So it does what it says it does on the tin, which is it splits the HDMI two ways. What I've got here, I've got a Raspberry Pi um, running Xbian uh, media player. And that's going, it's HDMI out here. It's being sent into this into the input of this splitter and the splitter is then going one way to this screen here and the other way to this screen here and it seems to be playing okay I haven't got any videos loaded at the moment let's see if I can find some on YouTube um, let's have a look if this works it seems to be updating fine on both screens anyway let's have a look Go search, have a look at this thing, whatever this is. One thing to note is that the oh, I just have to put something in. Um I'll do. any videos I thought you could just browse YouTube explore YouTube I've not updated YouTube for a long time on this so that's probably what it is as I say it seems to be updating fine it seems to be playing fine <laughs> And this has been plugged into our one of our lecture theatres for a good few weeks now. And it's not seemed to crash at all. Um, but we're trying to get it to work with a capture card, which is being captured on a PC for streaming purposes. But the capture card is probably the weakest link in this. Um, but I thought I'd just come home and just test the splitter anyway. There seems to be like a delay between one of the pictures. Challenges our own sense of priority in the universe. Human beings have a horrible track record of following people with great power. And absolute power corrupts absolute chaos. Maybe he's just a guy trying to do the right thing. Better not. 